The Teacher's Overview of the TPAC Teaching and Learning Framework. Education technology is integrated into classrooms every day. According to Pav Mavati, educational technology is the implementation of appropriate tools, techniques, or processes that facilitate the application of the senses, memory and cognition to enhance the teaching practices and improve learning outcomes. Educational technology is chalk and a blackboard, or the dry erase whiteboard. Educational technology is also many other forms of technology that teachers use in the classroom. It can be a struggle finding out what technology is best suited for certain lesson plans. Teachers can find it hard to find what technology best suits their curriculum, their students' knowledge, and learning objectives for their classrooms. Thus, to address the challenges of integrating technology into lesson planning, the conceptual framework known as TPAC, Technological, Pedagogical, and Content Knowledge. TPAC is a teaching and learning model to help in-service teachers, pre-service teachers, and student teachers to integrate educational technology in an effective and meaningful manner into lesson plans. The concept of TPAC is a synthesis that emerges between three domains, content knowledge, pedagogical knowledge, and technological knowledge. The interplay, interplay of the three domains are inseparable. TPAC is not a unique construct, but a combination of content knowledge, pedagogical knowledge, and technological knowledge that emerges during teaching and learning experiences. The implications of understanding the TPAC model can affect a teacher's professional development. They can help make teaching and learning more effective in the classroom. There are seven components to the TPAC framework. First one, technology knowledge. This refers to the knowledge of educational technology out in the field, existing and emerging. Second component, content knowledge, is the discipline content to be covered, taught, and learned by the teacher and student. Teachers should have developed content to be taught. Third component, pedagogical knowledge. This entails classroom management, lesson planning, teaching aids, prior learning experiences, level of difficulty of content, and data collection of assessments and evaluations. Fourth component, technology content knowledge. This refers to the knowledge of technology in the field relating to discipline content that is to be covered in a teacher's lesson plan, such as using software application that shows how a cell works in a biology lesson. Fifth component, technology pedagogical knowledge. This refers to differentiated practice of pedagogy to implement technology into a lesson plan. Sixth component, pedagogy content knowledge. Refers to the organization of content knowledge with teaching practice or pedagogy and the professional development of pedagogy. The final and seventh component, Technology, Pedagogy, Content Knowledge, TPAC, is the teacher's understanding of integration of technology in respective content areas, the teacher's knowledge of content in a given subject area, and the knowledge of pedagogy. Use the appropriate technologies to deliver the content. TPAC has many features to help teachers understand when it is appropriate to incorporate technology into a lesson. It can guide teachers how to use technology when it comes to their own content knowledge, technology knowledge, and pedagogy knowledge. There is much more information about the TPAC framework at tpac.org. Will you, as an in-service teacher, pre-service teacher, or student teacher, be interested in implementing the TPAC framework to help you professionally develop on how to integrate technology in your classroom? Let us know by, by completing our survey on our website. Thank you for your time and letting us know. Ciao.